How will I gain access to the headmaster's office? Perhaps Professor Fig will know what to do. Handy resource indeed. Why do I feel like this is where we get the polar juice potion? <laughs> No. There we go. Professor Fig, need to talk to you. I just friggin' sit on the floor. Professor Fig, the, has something changed? Lodgok and I have learned that the goblins are searching for another repository, and I discovered that they're building mass. Professor Fitzgerald seems. I see. Ranrock. And sir, there's some. He knew Miriam? They encountered each other at Rookwood Castle. She was doing research. He liked her so much that he let her leave with it. Despite. I don't know what to say. She could win. I want to hear more of this. And, in fact, I'd like to speak with Lodgok directly. Believe it or not. Incredible. All right. You'll need the password to get past the stone gargoyle. The headmaster's house elf will know it. I've actually met Scrope, but I'm not sure he'll tell me. He's rather devoted to the Black family. He is. So you'll need a disguise. I have just the thing. A polyjuice potion. Wait, doesn't polyjuice potion require a bit of the person? It does. So how do you already have poly... One never knows when such a thing may come in handy. Let's just say I felt the need to be prepared for anything after my fruitless trip to the ministry on his behalf. Now, time is of the essence. Drink up and I shall explain more. Oh, God. How do you feel? Uh, incredible. I won't forget that taste anytime soon. <clears throat> How do I sound? Convincing. I've taken the liberty of transfiguring your robes. As we discussed, you'll need the password from Scrope, who could be anywhere in the castle. You might look for Professor Kagawa. She's taken to badgering the poor elf about Quidditch in the hopes that he can convince Black to change his mind. Thus far, unsuccessfully. I see. But what if Professor Black sees me? Leave him to me. I shall tell him where to meet a liaison from the Ministry in Hogsmeade. That should give you plenty of time. Thank you, Professor. I suppose... It's rather strange to hear gratitude coming from Professor Black. <laughs> now to find the Headmaster's house elf. As long as I don't need to walk all dignified and shit, I guess we're all right. God almighty. Do you have a moment, Professor? Professor, shit. I was hoping to catch you. I... Oh, I, um, places to be, Professor Sharp. Places to be. Of course, sir. Only, <clears throat> you'd asked me about a particular potion, and I... Well, I... I did? I did, yes. Well, spit it out, Sharp. I don't have all day. Probably best not to discuss it here, sir. Really? Why can't we talk about potions here? Seems fine to me. Very well. I've brewed the cure for boils you wanted. I can drop it by your office when it's convenient. <laughs> of course, yes. No need for all the cloak and dagger. Simply have a student deliver it. A student. Very well, sir, if you insist. I do. And thank you, Sharp. I just hope you've brewed enough for all my boils. Now, to determine which student gets this rather unenviable... Greetings! I mean, out of my way, children. I haven't time for any of you at the moment. None. None at all. Move aside. 
Good God. Fuck if the headmaster won. Gareth! Uh, uh, Mr. Weasley! What are you. Oh, Professor. Yes, of course. All sorts of places I'd rather be right now. Uh, I'm looking for my house elf. Ah, the little one eared fellow. I saw him heading to the Great Hall moments ago. Muttering on about your, um, sterling gr I am watching you, Mr. Weasley. Mr. Redding, who owns Honeydukes, tells me some of his billywig stings recently went missing. Prime <laughs> potion ingredient. And I know you fancy yourself a skilled potioneer. What? But, sir, I haven't been anywhere near Honeydukes. I... Bah! That's enough from you. Just know that I have eyes and ears everywhere. On your way, Mr. Weasley. <laughs> well, there's one for my diary. That oh, was actually kind of funny, all of it. <laughs> you call that a shine on those boots? Do better. Piss off, please. How are you, sir? Mr. Gaunt, where do you think you're going? I beg your pardon, sir. I'm simply on my way outside. Taking the day off, eh? Typical student, wasting the hours away. I... I have to write 20 inches on Dittany and its uses was heading to the greenhouse. Ah, yes. Mixed with, uh, Bubo tuba pus makes a, a fine, uh, mustache paste. Yes, mustache paste. Uh, I find. <clears throat> Are you feeling all right, sir? You don't seem yourself. I assure you, I am quite healthy, Gaunt. If I need a medical diagnosis, I shall head to St. Mungo's. Something is... <clears throat> I wonder almost daily why I accepted this appointment from the Ministry. Professor, a word? I should like to speak with you, Professor. Professor Black, again, it is not too late to reconsider your decision regarding Quidditch. We... We could still have trials and a somewhat shortened season. It would be better than none at all. But the injury, Madam Kagawa. Professor, more than one student has taken a bludger to the head on our pitch. I dare say it knocked some sense into them. And they are fine now. The fact that it happened to be a pure blood, well, that's no reason to... What nonsense! That you would trivialize the health of a student over a, a silly game. A silly game? You are quite impossible sometimes. Sir, I've a good mind to write to the Department of Magical Games and Sports at the Ministry about you. Good idea. I can even provide the parchment should you need it. Now, where is my elf? I... parchment? Very well, I will, and with pleasure. And I spotted Scrope in the Great Hall. Seems to be avoiding me. Hmm, I wonder why. Good day, Madam Kagawa. <laughs> what did we do to deserve him as a headmaster? Chewing with your mouth open? Where are your manners? <laughs> Please say we get to see Sebastian in this hall. Chrysalia Bloom. Miss Broom, a word. Oh, Professor, this is an uh, interesting surprise. It's Bloom, by the way. Remind me of your area of affinity, Broom. OWLs are swift approaching. Charms, sir. Nonverbal spells. Might work on one that makes me disappear. Well, keep at it, Broom. And before you know it, you'll be as invisible as that new fifth year seems to be. Well, they're as good as invisible to me, sir. Rotten little extortionist holding my diary hostage. What was that, Broom? Uh, nothing, sir. <laughs> Speaking of invisible, where's my blasted house elf? Something seems a little off with the headmaster. Please say I got told it to Sebastian. Please. Stand proud, pure 
bloods. <clears throat> the future is yours. I don't even see house points for anyone. Professor, a word, please. Shit. Hello, Professor Black. Ah, Professor Weasley. How, how delightful to see you. Sir? Ah, uh, since I have you here, I wonder if I might, um, speak with you about Professor Fig. Oh, very well. I've decided to give him a bit more, uh, leeway with his time. Leeway, Professor? Are you sure that's wise? I confess I do worry for his students. He's rarely here as it is. Ah, well, yes. He's handling some official ministry business for me. I see. But, sir, if I may, I am wary of how much time the new fifth year seems to be spending away from the castle, supposedly on Professor Fig's behalf. I've heard unsettling rumors of their escapades. Everything from sneaking into the Forbidden Forest to confronting Ranrock's loyalists and Rookwood's lot. <coughs> what? <coughs> Goodness. Well, you cannot believe everything you hear, Professor. No, 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 you cannot. Uh, <coughs> I mean, I shall keep an eye on Fig. You simply keep doing the wonderful job that you're doing. <laughs> simply wonderful. I... Well, I... Um, thank you. But I'm happy to look in for uh, Good, good. That'll be all, Weasley. Uh, I mean, Professor Weasley. Good day. A wonderful job. Leeway for Professor Fig. I shall never understand it. That ought to give Professor Fig some breathing room. <laughs> What a wonderful job Scrope is doing. Scrope! Oh, greetings, Master. Remind me of the password to my office. Oh, but Master made Scrope swear never to tell anyone. Even Master himself. How dare you question me? I've a mind to give you a matching set of ears. Uh, uh yes, sir. Uh, of course, sir. Uh, Scrope begs forgiveness. It is the Black Family motto, Master. Hmm. Right. Of course. I, uh... Master does remember it. Time to look this up. Because... This is interesting. I don't know. Yeah. Yeah, sorry. Uh, hold on. It's to do with the purity of blood. It's pure blood forever, isn't it? Uh, uh, close, Master. Uh, Scrope thinks Master is indeed testing Scrope. Uh, it is always pure <laughs> obviously and of course as master knows in french ah yes of course uh i order you to pronounce it for me uh, master knows that scrope's french is most pitiful uh, oh very well uh, toujours pure uh, there is another matter scrope i confiscated this filthy diary from a student it smells of squid and seawater. Oh, Apollonia's diary. <clears throat> that is quite a surprise, Master. What do you wish Scrope to do with this treasure? Uh, the rubbish. Whatever you wish, Scrope. It's your treasure. Now, off with you. Uh. <laughs> Ahem. Attention, students. I hereby decree that the Great Hall be forthwith decorated in the stunning banners of Slytherin. I shall be taking no questions at this time, or ever. <laughs> God, man, stop belching. It's making it even worse for yourself. 
Made it just in time. It's wearing off. Fig was right. I can't believe it worked. Now to speak the password to the gargoyle. Nice to see you too. Taking a while for it to upload, isn't it? No upload update. Here we go. It's a shame we didn't get to speak to Sebastian. <laughs> I'd have loved to have spoken to Sebastian while I was Professor Black. <laughs> Oof. Don't think I'll bother with that just yet. I'll deal with that another time. <laughs> Whoops, wrong spell. God, the size of that. Friggin' twenty. Mm -hmm. <coughs> Rebellion. Centaur armor. That one at least makes sense. A level 3 lock right underneath the headmaster's office? You know I'm gonna. Oh, this is the office of the deputy headmistress. Ooh, boy. Just trying to be here too long. Could it be in the next room, maybe? Sounds like it's coming from even higher. Aloha Mora. So is he even the same lock? Jesus. Rebellion.
Stuff are coming from above. Professor Sharp, so interesting. The gargoyle. That's where I need to speak the password. Follow cogs. Toujours pure. I wonder if all the elite wizarding families have a motto. I very well might. Herschela. Herschela Black. Interesting. Revelio. Aloha Mora. Regarding your letter dated the 20th of September, I shall not reconsider the admin, the admissions process at Hogwarts. The key of admittance. That could be what unlocks that uh, door. So let's give that a whirl, shall we? Great. I guess I'll be coming back here a bit later then. It's good to see you. All thanks to Professor Fig's quick thinking. Now what? Approach the pedestal in the antechamber and read the book that appears. 
I suspect that your suspicions are correct. Has this been under the headmaster's nose all this time? Seems like it. You see, hair tonic mushroom marks, bondemon pomade, pearl handled comb, gold handled back scratcher, toxicide, paid in very small parts, reminder, reminder to be built to ministry. Oh, wow! So he's a cheapskate as well. That must be the pedestal. Excuse me. Where am I? Professor Fitzgerald? Can you hear me? I am here. In this place, you may call me Eve. You shall be witness to a fable. Pay attention. Things are not always as they seem. Okay. Move swiftly and cautiously. Use the tools you encounter to find me. The first you will need is a cloak. The cloak of invisibility, maybe? In this place, as in life, death takes many forms. Avoid each of them at all costs. What the fuck is this? Death Eaters? Or just death itself? Death Shadow. Okay. Was not expecting that, although... I am now tempted to try and do something like this in a campaign. my chance. I'm coming, Neve. I need to time this just right. Uh-huh. Staircase straight ahead. Death. Hello, Death. Looking for anyone in particular? As long as it ain't me, be good, yeah? How did this happen? A ladder. Perhaps they won't be able to find me if I go up there. Death's Dark Mongrel. Oh, good lord. They're gone. For now. I need to get out of here. Where could Neve be? <gasps> Too many. I must cross this road as fast as I can. That's where I need to go, but I need to find a way past them. 
Yeah, shut up and we'll get past them. Just for the love of God, don't sneeze. Whatever you do, don't even sneeze. Again, death. Nothing this way, but more danger. There must be another way to find you. <coughs> I need to turn back. There's no getting past them that way. Thank you. Close. That doorway looks like the only safe way forward. Don't move a muscle. Now's my chance. What is this? The Deathly Hallows all of a sudden? Is that actually the case? Am I in the book of the Deathly Hallows? They can't see me at all. I can get closer to them. I feel like I'm in the book of the Deathly Hollows. This is the way forward. Finally free. Now where are you, Neve? I didn't appreciate the stealth. The older wand. Now all I need is the resurrection stone. You could toss the older one due to the way it's designed. I've never felt such power. And you never will again, mate. Oh yeah, that's the other one, all right. Oh boy. Stupid. 
And now who's messaging me? Uh, Saki. I'll ask her if she wants to join the last bit of the bottom. Well, I say the last bit. I don't know how long I'm going to be recording for after this. But who knows, maybe having someone here will actually... Wake me up a bit. <laughs> Just give it a second. I'm gonna have some water actually while she replies. <laughs> oh, oh. oh my arm. Jeez. Okay, so it sounds like she's been up and doing stuff. <laughs> but she... I love the fact that she's just like, you could have said you were going to record, I would have dropped. Fine. <laughs> I'm not exactly going to interrupt her, she's doing summer. <laughs> I'm not that sort of person. If I f see you offline, I just think you're either going to be busy or asleep. Considering she's getting ready for the con down, like, it's not the London one, but it's one of the others that's um, down south from where we live. So it's like, I know she's getting ready for that, so obviously I'm not going to, like, I'm obviously not going to, like, interrupt so if she's doing something for the con. Because that's what I feel like she'd be doing, getting herself ready for that. Oh, hello again, Death. Don't tell me I have to fight you now. Death's troll. Got him in the leg. Will you, sucker? Death is not happy at me, is he? Oh. 
Bad boy. Hello. Hello. There we go. How are you? Apart from being busy quite a lot today, am I? What are you recording? I'll go outside because he. He's just going to play with me. I'm at this part. Oh. Yeah. yeah. Which, you know, I'm assuming is essentially the storybook of the Deathly Hallows. It is. Yeah. I not really that much of a spoiler for sure about yeah, it, so yeah, yeah, it is. I, I figured as much, considering the invisibility cloak and the Elder Wand, I'm just like, okay, last thing we need is the Stone Resurrection. Or the Stone of Resurrection. I'm gonna get that next. Yeah. You don't really have to do much for that one. You know, so it's safe to say, considering I've been in combat and I've done the stuff, I will admit I do like the art style of this section. It is despite, nice. Despite the fact that it's all just essentially all outlines so and shading and shit. This must be for me. Like, this is probably like the simplest part in terms of design, but it it's looks so fucking good. It does. I feel bad for the developers because they were just like, must resist urge to fill with colour. Must resist urge. I, I think it would be easier not to do colour. <laughs> Finions. <laughs> It's weird because it's all about Neem, but like, it's also the Deathly Hallows, so was she. But the Deathly Hallows was all about the three brothers. You found She's just using it as a. Do what has been done. As a way for her to do a the test. The magic of the stone can only conjure a shadow of my former self. He's just using it as inspiration, basically. Yeah. I'm always tempted to use this in a campaign. I wouldn't blame you. Whether it's no Celestial War no or Persona. Yes. You can Keep adding more darkness. things to the <laughs> current <laughs> campaign. <laughs> <laughs> That's running. <laughs> uh, I'll probably use it for Persona. Remember that, as you witness my memory. That could be a way of facing like the Grim Reaper or something in it. Yeah. It's like you just get swallowed into a storybook. Also, it stops from farming the Grim Reaper. Yeah. <laughs> you know, Although like what you can do it. Yeah. To be fair, though, the Persona games are just essentially a different version of D and D. They are. Egor's the dungeon master. <laughs> I actually said that in a post on Tumblr this morning. What? <laughs> yeah. What you did for your father nice. remarkable, wasn't it? Did you see those things where I sent where it's just each of the Persona casts D and D classes? Hmm. I think I did. Yeah. You haven't stopped. I wouldn't be surprised if you like, haven't. It is quite far back. I don't know why I'm still colouring this one in. Given up. You sound like Percival. And as it happens, I do know. It is a source of strength, of focus. Somehow. 
Does that mean Dumbledore was kind of named after uh, after him? <laughs> I don't follow. After who? His name. Yeah. To... Although he has plenty of fucking names. Hmm. I, kind of I don't like the name memes. <laughs> Can't believe she's like, just done that to the headmistress. Yep. Breathe it in. She's gone fucking crazy with what she's able to do. Oh, it's Adora. This must stop. It goes even more insane. That doesn't surprise me one bit. I don't think that's spoilers. It's... You fear it. I choose to embrace it. This is ridiculous. I can't believe she's gone this far. And the headmistress is clearly not happy about having her pain taken away. Would you? No, well, if it cures my fucking mental illnesses, yeah, I'd be alright with that. <laughs> I mean, to be fair, if, if that was all it did, same. Mm, but obviously we don't know what else it could have done, so... But yeah, legit. <laughs> On Tumblr, I even stated that Persona is just D and D, and he got the fucking DM. Is it true? Has someone completed? You're not really wrong, trials? though. I even stated that the one with the wild card is just multi-classed into every class. I know. You must be Professor Yeah. I am. And depending on how strong the personas are, depends on the level of the fucking class. She was. It was disturbing. But how did she gain power from it? How did she harness it? It was disturbing. Although I wonder that you are asking about her power. I hesitate to reveal the location of my pensive to someone who perhaps has yet to understand the responsibility of power. I can assure you, Professor, I do. In fact, what you don't yet know is that a dangerous goblin Is it just me, or does he have, like, a twinge of Daniel Radcliffe in his voice? He learns to harness the contents of it as a source of a... What, the main character? He plans yeah. To that power Tiny bit. Kind. We have no time to waste. I see. Nonetheless... The knowledge you shall gain after you witness my memories is too valuable to share without further consideration. Oh, what? Just because we asked a couple of questions? Just because we asked a couple of questions, but go screw yourself, dick. Right, no offense to him, but when I was doing, like, his pensive and shit, it was like... It basically just went over everything we already know. Oh my god, seriously. Without permission. It had like one or two extra details, but it basically just went over everything we already know, and I was just like, "What was with this? Like, this shit's important." Possibly. There's something. So we already know half this. Ranrock has been digging at locations tied to the five names he found in the journals of a goblin metal worker named. And I was just so confused. The keepers and who else? Isadora Morganak. Precisely. That's how he's been one step ahead of us. Gringotts, the tower, Rookwood Castle. If the keepers won't tell you where the next trial is yet, I say we at least maintain a watch on Ranrock. Perhaps he'll lead us. Perhaps. I hope to hear from Rockgott soon. Da, 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 I have... I oh, see and that. as you've probably guessed by now, your polyjuice plan. I knew it would. Oh, I have done too good a job to You did that back. point. I had no idea. Hmm? You can't hold his. Plan you did that part. <laughs> Yeah, I was so hoping we could meet Sebastian and just be like, hey, yeah, um, it'd be great if you could carry on with the dark magic. I think I went and saw Sebastian on my one because I went and talked to everyone possible. Why? Where was he? Because I couldn't find him. I, I didn't find it. I didn't find him on the set. So Did you? Speaking of Sebastian. <laughs> I Did you go up to the um, the Owl Podium yes. when you were the head? Yes. <laughs> uh, I, 
I ended up saying uh, that the Grand Hall will now be decorated with the banners of Slytherin. Yeah, do you know what was funny? God. That's kind of expected for like for yours and for like him char his character in general because he was a Slytherin. Yeah. But for you, it was Hufflepuff. Me, he said, he said Hufflepuff, <laughs> so it was even funnier because <laughs> he would not say that in reality. <laughs> I bet everybody was just like, what the frick are you on about? <laughs> All right, let's... So amazing. I love that part. Oof. I remember spamming it into the, the group messenger, uh, messenger chat when <laughs> I was doing it. Because I couldn't stop oh, laughing. God. So I need Bombarda for that, which I've got. Phoenix Rising. I think this is where we're gonna get our Phoenix for the uh, for the thing. Which is good because I've only got the Graphorn and the Phoenix left to get. Yeah, they're both um, quests. Ah. You can't get them out of it. Fair enough. Because I'm there looking get... around for like Graphorn Den and I'm just like, yeah, no. I know where the Graphorn Den is, not just because I fucking completed the game, but. Because I genuinely, before the thing was like, why aren't they spawning? Some exciting news to share. Mm. But no, I've, I looked it up after that and was like, oh. <laughs> yeah, you can only get one of each as well. Yeah, same with the unicorn. Indeed, the no. Oh, you can get one more. That you want to learn about yeah. a phoenix nest. Would not it's only it. those the. The phoenix and the thingy that you can't oh, get it. more of. Deke thinks so. Deke is not sure. Deke hopes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Everything yeah, else. Yeah, what, um, what Deke thinks. You because don't like Deke, do you? It's just the whole repetitiveness of like, Deke thinks this, Deke thinks that, and I'm just like, I don't. Well, care. to be fair, all of the house elves do it. Yeah, but we also don't have to deal with all of the other house elves as much. Yes, but we did see it with Dobby, because Dobby is a free elf. Dobby is free. He's... They always refer to themselves in the third person for stuff. Yeah, and it annoyed the hell out of me when Dobby did it. As much as I like Friends. Dobby, he still annoyed the shit out of me with it. It is kind of annoying after a while. Just like with the flu powder, bitch. <laughs> oh, God. I think everyone in the in the player base is so annoyed with that. Oh yeah, because like one of the people I watch has started streaming this like yesterday. Uh, she wasn't able to stream it today because like. That. Uh, that sounded like a troll. Um. Essentially, in terms of like, she wasn't able to do a stream due to the fact that uh, the teachers are doing like the national strike thing because she's got obviously she's got kids and stuff hence why she didn't yeah but otherwise she would have streamed Oh, um, if you want to have a Vada Kedavra before the end game, I'd recommend doing Sebastian's stuff as soon as possible and finishing the storyline quickly. Yeah. Your poaching days are over. Well, other than the main mission, I've not really heard of from him, so... Once I've done the main mission, hopefully I'll get some good new stuff. Well, you just had that letter from him, didn't you? Yes, and I was about the main mission. Okay, sorry, I'm. I haven't been on the game for a little while. Right of it. There you go, stupid bitch. <laughs> yeah. Phoenix Mountain Cave. I need to go back up to near the headmaster's uh, thing at one point because. Um, yeah, yeah. I got the admittance key. 
We're going to poke so I'm hoping that'll you. get me behind the door, but like... I'm hoping that'll get me near, but I'm hoping that'll open up the door. Yeah, I know what you want about. Yeah. I still need to do... I think I still need to do that as well. Cause like, I saw two chests in there. There's no way I'm leaving that be. Also, yeah, no, if you want to get all of the things, you have to get everything, like, literally, if you want to complete it. Also, oh my god, I finally found legendary fucking gloves. Mm. It's complicated to do that. I mean, for my last few sets, I had I, full legendary. I, I think it's a case of, like... It's random for each person that plays it. Because there's no way anybody will ever have the exact same set. Although, look at my defense and offense. Yes. Love it. What? Have you currently customized your outfit or is that just what? No, nah, that's just what the gear looks like. Ah, uh, okay. Because you can do that, you know. Yeah, I just haven't done it just yet. Just imagine the whole blooming bird. <sighs> I do it because I don't like those um, don't lizardy eye goggle things. Shit. You know I mean? Yeah. Back for more, maybe. I can control, and I will. I don't care if Bitch. you don't like it, bitches. Don't tell a Slytherin to not do dark magic. It's never gonna work. <laughs> I knew almost all of the, the curses when I did the end game, apart from the Avada Kedavra, but um, mm. I still didn't use a single one of them on the end boss. I'm gonna guess the end boss is Van. Oh, is that Isadora? Isadora... No! That bitch that's going crazy. No, it's not her. It's definitely Ranrock, but... Yeah. Oh! He wants to talk to you about Anne. That's his side quest. Yeah. Also, what the fuck is causing damage to me? Were you poisoned? I don't know. Must, must what were you have been fighting? Because I wasn't actually looking. Spiders. That's why. They can yeah. do that type of damage. I'm and it will like, leave like... I'm just like, wait, they actually got an attack off on me? Yeah. Too many. Yeah, legit. Oh. I need to get back on the game so I can actually complete it, complete the whole thing. Yeah. I have places where it tells me where everything is that I'm missing. Mm. But I can't be asked to go through every single one of them one by one on my own. Pumpkin! If I did, I'd like to have two screens on my fucking computer to do it, but I don't have that. No. Pumpkin, pump pumpkin. Halloween cannon. The phoenix. Why do I feel like this phoenix becomes fogs? And I'll raise you like a phoenix. Follow it. Legit. Why do I feel like that phoenix becomes fogs? Like, which is Dumbledore's most trusted phoenix. Fuck knows. Don't even know when when Fox was technically fucking born. Because they don't... Play. No, they don't. 
Like yeah, they just reborn themselves out of the ashes. You knew. Hello, Hamora. What level of Hello, Mori you got? Three. I know. You are now the most roguish rogue. More of a rogue than fucking Spectra. <laughs> and that's saying something. Yeah. There it is again. It's what it is. Yep. Aliu. Aliu. Then the spider web. Cause why the fuck not? I'm gonna assume with the fact that you thought I was asleep, you've not got any of the Facebook messages that are in the group chat. Mm, no. Last ones I got were from last night. And that was it. Mm. And that was like just before I decided to head to bed. There's enough. So I'm just like, I know she's been awake last night. I don't know if she's still awake though. They have not fully gone to bed properly since then, but have but have napped on the sofa because of the dizziness. I hate the fact that I saw a spider jump down into the chasm. It's like I didn't even get to see the full thing, it was just the legs. Deal with your arachnophobia. I've had enough of my arach arachnophobia. Unfortunately, this game goes fuck you, arachnophobic. Pretty much. I think that's the word for them, I don't know. Arachnophobes, yeah. Go on, end, I dare. Cause the moment you do... I would've just kept fucking spamming the buttons. Nah. Doesn't actually, for some reason, do any damage when you do that. Don't know why. Not for me. Weird. It's not for me. When I just spam the click button on the mouse, the basic cast. Nah, doesn't do that for me. Well, at least I think it does, because every time I did the basic cast, it hit something, so. Although, to be fair, most of the time I fucking did it, I was in a state of panic, so. Ah, uh, yeah. I'm constantly in a state of panic when a battle ensues. I love turning them into chickens. It's the best thing ever, isn't it? Mm-hmm. I love it. Every time it happens, I break down laughing. That was the highway. One less when I when I was doing it. Yeah. Let's see who's decided to message me. Well, it wasn't me. No, I was on Instagram. I don't even have your Instagram, me thinks. No, you don't. You've all got me Facebook. Not like I use What's fucking that? Instagram. I don't really use any social fucking media nowadays. I really need to get back into Instagram for my cosplay stuff. Now that I'm going back to cons and shit. Hmm. Oh, I like, managed to catch a couple of measles earlier. Yeah. I also streamed yesterday. Okay. It was mainly just the 
um, egg hatching. Mm. So nothing special, we didn't really miss much. It was more of just a test for like later because I'm thinking could maybe do things like um, long plays of PS2 games and stuff, so. Mm. Fair enough. Or, or anything else I decide to do. Sonic here. <laughs> I was waiting for you to say that. I guess we stream it and we just show everyone how crap Let's I am. Get you back to the room. Uh, it's not you that'll be playing though. It'll be me. <laughs> no, but we could. <sighs> no, it's the fucking number. Because I can't do w one thing at a time. You know, apart from when I'm fucking busy. Mm. Oh, there it is. It was in the leaves. But it's like, I may even do terror raids. Careful. Or... Um... What else? <laughs> Maybe even do some online battles or some... I don't know. Mm. Deke, we got the phoenix. You sure we got enough friggin' vivariums? Cause, uh, I think I've hit the species limit on all of them. Yeah, four of them. Okay, so yeah, I'll be fine then. Did you find the phoenix? Yes, Deke. And I rescued it from the poachers. I have it here. It's safe. Remarkable! Well, what are you waiting for? Deke cannot, cannot wait to... to... All right, take it easy. How many do you currently have? That's my last one. Phoenix feather. Hey, give me that. That belongs to me. What a thinking. Hey, <laughs> oi, mate. You keep it close. I wasn't looking at the screen. Oh, okay. My mom's watching crap on TV. Uh, well, not really watching it, it's just in the background. So, I kind of like what I do with recordings and stuff. 